Keeping your bushcraft shop, such as knives and axes, shop and in good nick is vital for allowing you to use these tools in a safe and proper manner. And that's where tool maintenance kits, like the one I've brought along today, come in. These kits can house all your tool, sharpening and maintenance equipment and accessories, allowing you to properly maintain and look after your shops. So in today's video, I'm going to be going through my tool maintenance kit and what I keep in it. Okay, so we'll start this off by talking about the pouch that I keep my tool maintenance accessories in. So as you can tell, this is actually just a camouflage pencil case. I love the colour of it. It's this lovely like hard wearing material. I know it's going to last a while. Front pouch here at obviously the front, just a small pouch and then the main big pouch. So yeah, it's meant to be a pencil case, but I use it to keep my tool things in. And the main reason why I use this pouch is because it's a perfect length to keep my sharpening stone and my sharpening other little accessory that I use to sharpen my stuff. So that's the pouch. Okay, so let's get into the actual contents of this pouch that I use to maintain all my tools and my axes and my knife mainly. That's the main things. Okay, so first off, the first front pouch, small pouch, keep some sandpaper in. That's for really all the tools. Just don't use it to sharpen them, but just to um, keep them in shape. And then this is some stropping compound. Looks a bit like soap. That's kind of what it's like, or like a waxy kind of thing and you'll see how that comes into play with my strop in a bit then if we open it up we see we've actually got the bigger items inside the pouch so inside the main compartment we start off by the thing at the bottom which is the main thing my sharpening so now usually this is in kitchen towel it's not at the minute but it's usually in that to dry out got a coarse side and a normal side and as you can tell i use it to sharpen and you can tell how much I've used this to sharpen and in which areas by the divots in it and all that. It's just a really cheap one. It's four pounds, but it works for me. I just soak this in water when I want to sharpen using it. And yeah, it's brilliant. Next thing is, I didn't really know how to explain this, but it's a knife sharpening system. I think that's the best way to describe it. So you hold it there on the table on your work surface obviously i wouldn't use this because it's a bit rickety you basically pull your knife through to sharpen it so it's got a fine sharpener and a coarse sharpener for each side and you just hold it down um it's about the same length as that so it fits perfectly in my kit together and so that's the second thing and i mainly use that just for i use this for proper sharpening the sharpening stone but i just use this for keeping them intact and like freshening them up and then finally i've got the strop so strop mainly when you think of sharpening you think of sharpening stones and stuff but the strop basically like helps remove that burr after you've sharpened your knife or axe and basically it just sharpens it up and if you've got a knife that isn't dull but just needs sharpening up a little bit that's where strop's super useful so obviously you can tell it's green from the strobbing compound you just do it and then you just let's say this was our knife you just drag it along to um finish it up so in conclusion strop stropping compound sandpaper knife sharpening system and sharpening stone so this is not a tool maintenance or sharpening guide or video i'm just going through the ki kit and gear that i use in order to maintain and sharpen my tools but i just thought i would briefly go over how i do it so the main two things i do is my knives and my axe now in terms of them all i do is i sharpen using the sharpening stone both of them, obviously, you use different techniques for both. And then I just finish it off with this job. And I also use that um, system, that knife sharpening system, to do my knife sometimes. So for the axe, you obviously get your axe. You take the um, the sharpening stone next to it. And that's where a puck would come in handy. But I just use my normal one and do it in a circular motion to sharpen it. And then for your knife, you get the knife to it and sharpen it. So yeah, that's how I sharpen my stuff using this kit. So my personal kit is by no means perfect, um, so a few additions that I would like to make in the future and as time goes on. Firstly, I would like to add a flannel that might seem a bit weird, but just to dry off either my piece that I'm working on, so my knife or my axe or whatever, and my kit after I've sharpened, and also to add just some friction so I don't... Um, so nothing slides on the table when I'm sharpening. I would also like to add a honing rod, which along with this strop allows you just to finish off the sharpening after you've used 
the stone. So that's what I would also like to add. I would also like to look into maybe getting a pook for my axe instead of using my sharpening stone. And maybe some more additions along the way. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please stay tuned for future videos. And please let me know down in the comments if you want to see any more videos about sharpening or tool maintenance. Because I can go over things like how I maintain my knife or my axe and sharpen them and all that. Because keeping your sharps, as I said in the intro, in good condition is essential to letting them work safely and properly. So, thanks for watching. Bye.